Equivalent fractions and decimals. Write four tenths as hundredths in fraction form and decimal form. Let's start with fraction form. We have a model divided into 10 equal parts. Let's shade four parts. Now we have four tenths. Let's take the same exact model and divide it into 100 equal parts instead of 10. Now let's shade four columns again. The area shaded is the same as the previous model, but now we have 40 parts shaded instead of four. So four tenths and 40 hundredths are equivalent fractions. To go from 4 tenths to 40 hundredths, we multiply the numerator and the denominator by 10. So 4 tenths equals 40 hundredths. Now let's write 4 tenths as hundreds in decimal form using a place value chart. We put the 0 in the 1's place, a 4 in the 10's place, and a zero in the hundredths place. So the fraction 4 over 10 can be written as a decimal as 4 tenths or 40 hundredths. Let's try another example. Write 70 hundredths as tenths in fraction form and decimal form. Let's start with fraction form. Unlike the previous question, this model is already divided into 100 equal parts. Shade 70 parts. These 70 shaded parts represent the fraction 70 hundredths. We have to write 70 hundredths as tens, so we take the same model but divide it into 10 parts. Shade in seven columns. We see that the area of the two shaded parts are the same. So 70 hundredths and 7 tenths are equivalent fractions. To get from 70 hundredths to 7 tenths, we have to divide both the numerator and the denominator by 10. So 70 hundredths equals 7 tenths. We wrote 70 hundredths as tenths in fraction form. Now let's do the same thing in decimal form. Let's write 70 hundredths using the place value chart. We put a 0 in the 1's place, a 7 in the 10's place, and a 0 in the 100's place. We have to write 70 hundredths as tenths in decimal form. There are no hundredths, so we can erase the zero in the hundredths place. We get seven tenths. Seven tenths is the equivalent decimal to 70 hundredths. Equivalent decimals are decimals that name the same amount. If you thought this video was helpful, please leave a like. For more videos like this, please subscribe.